made you blow my reputation But the figure is not on me Yeah, yeah, yeah The way you're making me show your hands on myself I keep pulling the trigger, all right This very finger for people like them Oh, no, no But darling, oh, my, my I'm feeling so fly up in the zone now I'm like a golden crown Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is a classic luxury haul. I've been doing some shopping and getting some new and pieces in, so I'm gonna be sharing with you what I got. I also have a new bag to share with you, and I actually have two bags to share, um, but one is more for comparison purposes. My first ever Loewe bag, which I'm very, very excited about, so I will be sharing that as well. I hope you guys enjoy this, and let's get started. Okay, so first up is this absolutely gorgeous cardigan slash jacket it is a cardigan but I feel like there's a bit more structure to it than your standard cardigan and I thought this was just absolutely stunning like I love it so much it really reminds me of a certain designer but at a much better price point and it's just so chic very French looking and I'm just obsessed with it probably one of my favorite items in this haul but to be honest there are a lot of strong contenders um it's a fairly heavyweight knit I would say um you can definitely still wear this in spring maybe not in the dead of summer um but it's a really nice transitional one because it is a little bit more heavyweight than your normal cardigan but at the same time it's not a full-on heavy jacket it is a very classic white and black stripe and it is a horizontal one and you do have buttons all the way down um but the buttons are actually so it's actually a hook closure and then the buttons on the front are actually just for show so it fastens in a different way but it means that it's very easy to get on and off you can also wear this just open as well for a very kind of casually chic and elegant look the button detailing is beautiful it's a very shiny gold so it makes it look really expensive and fancy even though i feel like the price was really reasonable and it just kind of fits perfectly and it's just one of those super chic pieces you know you'll be able to throw this over a dress over a skirt denim faux leather leggings like whatever you wanted to and i feel like it would instantly make it look so chic and pulled together and I am just thrilled with this and I can't believe I don't already have something like this in my wardrobe. I do have kind of plain versions, um, but nothing in this beautiful black and white stripe and I am just beyond thrilled with it. This beautiful piece is from a brand called Goelia and Goelia were nice enough to partner with me on this video. I don't remember the last time I was this excited about a new clothing brand discovery. Their items are absolutely gorgeous, like all very, very classic and timeless, but at the same time, they're not stuffy at all. Like they're all done in quite a fresh way and they have everything from beautiful knitwear to really elegant dresses and skirts. They have silk blouses, like it is the full spectrum and everything is so beautifully made. They really focus on fabric quality and everything is just gorgeous. Like I'm so happy with my order. I am gonna be sharing quite a few of their pieces in today's video. So I will be linking everything down below. I will also pop in my sizes as well because the size I took are a little bit different from my standard sizes in other stores. So I will make sure to include all that sizing information in the description section as well. They were also nice enough to give me a discount code as well. So you can take a huge 25% off your full price purchase and it works off all the items I'm sharing here today. So I will pop that code on screen as well as in the description section if you did want to check that out. Next up is this gorgeous dress and I thought this was the funnest most chic thing ever I am absolutely in love with it so it's very kind of whimsical it is a little black dress um, but there are a lot of special features of this one so you have this gorgeous tool material with this kind of polka dot element all the way through there is this gentle ruffle detail on the neckline and then you do have that polka dot detailing carry through to the sleeve and it is a stretchy tool sleeve as well and then in the body you do have a nice mass stretch and I'm not sure if you'll be able to see this but I will try and do a close-up there is that polka dot element carrying all the way through and then you have this fantastic tiered skirt so you have a lot of ruffles it's definitely more on the girly side but I think it's just gorgeous like so so stunning it is fully lined as well very very soft and silky to touch so it's very very comfortable to wear and this does come with a belt to cinch it in as well so the belt it comes with is a nice simple kind of fabric belt that you just tie on the back you can of course swap in your own belt as well and I think it looks fantastic both ways 
I thought this was so different and unusual, like really, really girly and feminine, but at the same time, it's quite sophisticated as well. There's a lot of detailing, but because it isn't all black, it doesn't feel like too much. I always love my polka dots anyway, and the fact this is black on black just makes it feel a little bit more edgy while still being like very classic. And I am just so, so obsessed with this dress. I cannot wait to wear it. Perfect for a dinner date or any kind of nice event. I feel like this would be a great birthday dress as well. Just such a beautiful piece I am so in love with. We have our anniversary coming up very, very soon. We've been married five years, which is crazy. Been together 10 years, married five years. Um, so we are having a little dinner date to celebrate. So I think I'm going to wear this then and I'm just so excited about it, it is absolutely gorgeous. Now for a skirt, and this is another strong contender for favourite because it's just right up my street in terms of just a really solidly classic piece that you'll be able to team with so many things, doesn't date at all, and is just so flattering and wearable. It's like one of those kind of backup wardrobe options which when you don't know what to wear, it's something you can grab and you know it's always gonna work, you're always gonna feel great in it, and this is pretty much it, just like the perfect example of what it is. I mean, it is an A-line skirt and it's quite full, so you get a lot of volume with it. It's a lot of fun to wear. The fabric is so nice as well, so it's going to be difficult to describe and I'm not super up my fabrics, but it has almost like a kind of semi sheen to it. So it feels very nice and smooth to the touch without being kind of shiny or anything like that. It's just a really beautiful one, which is wonderfully crease proof as well, which is always such a huge thing for me in skirts. Like I just don't want to be worried about my skirt creasing when I sit down and then getting back up. It's just not something I want to be dealing with. Whereas this is just perfect in that sense, like really, really low maintenance. It does come with pockets as well, which is always such a huge bonus for me. It zips up as well, very, very nice fit. You have a medium width waistband and it's just kind of perfect in terms of the design and execution. Really, really elegant. You can wear this with flats, you can dress it up with heels and wear it with pretty much anything you want. You know, it would look great with just a simple cami or bodysuit. You can also wear it with a biker jacket if you wanted to toughen up, a little blazer. So many different options and oh, just like the perfect, perfect version of what it is. And now for another cardigan, and this one is a little bit more fitted than the first one that I showed, which was more of like a kind of semi-jacket style. This one is much more fitted, so it kind of cinches in a little bit there at the waist, if you can see that. And it has this fantastic two-tone colorway. So it does have um, a cream base with this black trim and these beautiful pearl detail buttons. So you have a braided gold trim and then the pearl right there in the middle. You do have two faux pockets right there on the front, and then you have have a black band on the waistline which is where it kind of cinches in so you can almost like tuck it up and over if you wanted to have more of like a tucked in look you can wear it down if you want to as well the knit on it is just beautiful it has this really really pretty pattern to it and on the sleeves you have this very slight puff sleeve so it is very on trend but it's done in a very classic way it is a lovely v-neck so you can choose whether to button it all the way up you can leave it open just have one button open just depending on your preference. It's a very soft knit as well. I'd say it's kind of like a medium weight, not super flimsy, but not super heavy either. So just right for this time of year. And how lovely is that? Just so, so classic. I think this would look great with a little Chanel bag and a little skirt. Just very, very elegant and just so timeless in this design. And now for a little bit of color because we are approaching summer and it is getting very, very warm here indeed. But how beautiful is this? It just absolutely springs summer in a dress and I do love my floral patterns but this is just the prettiest thing. So it kind of has like a watercolor element to it. Really, really lovely. The colors are so stunning. So it's a pale pink base and it is quite a shiny fabric as well. So it drapes in the most beautiful way. And then the flower print is just this stunning mix of rosy pinks and reds. You have a little bit of green, a little bit of blue in there as well, some cream. It's just so beautiful. Like it's the nicest, nicest color palette. And then it is a kind of semi roughly one. So it's it's a cold shoulder piece, so you do have the straps, then you do have this off the shoulder look with the little ruffle sleeves as well. You have that floral print carrying all the way through, and then you have this draped extra bit of fabric right there on the bust. It is so beautiful. You could belt this if you wanted to. I think I'm probably just gonna wear it as is because I think the print is enough just to speak for itself. 
but it's just so so pretty um it is quite a full long skirt as well you do just have the one tier with a fair amount of fabric but it's also wonderfully light so very very cool to the touch i feel like this would be great even on the hottest summer day and I just thought this was the prettiest thing, like perfect if you have, you know, a nice brunch to go to or like a bridal or a baby shower, anything like that. Or even if you just want to take it on holiday, just the prettiest dress. And I am so in love with this print. And now for this stunning blouse, which is so elegant and ladylike. There's a lot of really beautiful detailing on it. Um, so it has this slightly exaggerated collar. Um, not so much that it's anything too crazy. Like I absolutely feel like this would be appropriate in a work setting, but also really elegant for a nice dinner as well. It has a sharp pointed collar right there and then you do have buttons all the way down but it is a hidden button so you have this front little panel there. Very very elegant in the details. It drapes down, the fabric is so incredibly silky soft like you just want to run your hands over it all day long. I believe it's 100% silk so it is amazing quality and the sleeve has this kind of pleated crepe like design. Really lovely and um, it is cuffed right at the sleeves as well. And how beautiful is this? Just like so, so elegant. You have a nice fold down there on the back too. I think this would work really beautifully with a skirt, but equally lovely just dressed down with a pair of jeans as well. And I just feel like this is so classic, you know, something you'll be able to return back to time and time again. I feel like this would go beautifully with some pearl jewelry as well. Just kind of really bring out the beautiful white color. And I just think this is the loveliest, loveliest thing. And then next up, I have this beautiful dress and it probably doesn't look that much on screen but I will do a cutaway so you can actually see what it looks like on me. Um, this one is just such a classic lovely piece and it's a very simple kind of sheath design so it's a scoop neck one with a medium thick strap and then it just kind of flares out into a very gentle A-line. I did team this one with a belt just to define my waist a little bit and I love the overall look. I thought it looked so seamless, really really elegant. It kind of reminds me of the Prada dresses they did a few years ago and the cut of it is just so lovely. This one does come with pockets as well. Again, I can't emphasize enough how much I love a pocket. It's just so practical and just, it always feels very modern to me. Um, and then you do have a beautiful silky lining. So again, it feels really, really nice on your skin. It zips up on the side there and everything is very well constructed in terms of, you know, all the zips are completely hidden. They're all very seamless. It's all just very well done and very well made. And the fabric quality is just really clear as soon as you feel the fabrics, like they are really truly lovely. And I just love this. And um, this one did come with its own belt as well. I did swap in my own one, but you can obviously wear it with the belt it came with. I think it looks great. And yeah, I'm just so happy with this. I have slowly been replenishing my work wardrobe. We have a few more meetings coming up, so I desperately needed a little update. And I feel like this is the kind of thing that you can wear it to a dinner date, but you can also wear it to work. And I just really love really versatile, multifunctional pieces. Next up is the new bag that I got in. So this is very, very new. I literally just received it, but I am so over the moon with it. I have been eyeing up the Loewe basket bags for quite a while now, and they have so many. Like if you type in Loewe and look under their bag section, there are just so many varieties. Like they have large ones and small ones and printed ones and tropical ones, <laughs> just so many different styles. Um, and then I saw this one. I thought it was adorable. And um, so I do have the larger size here as well because I wasn't sure which one I would go for. I decided on the mini one. I'm like 99% sure. I do really like the larger one as well, which is why I'm hesitant. Um, but I'm pretty sure I'm keeping this one. Um, but it's just absolutely adorable. So it's a kind of little mini shopper bag style. It obviously has Loewe right there on the front. And then it does come with a little long strap as well. My only little niggle with it is I wish that the strap was easier to attach and then remove. Um, as it stands, it's the leather fastening, so you do have to maneuver it a little bit, but that is fairly minor. And this one is adjustable too. So if you wanted to make it longer, you can do. And I love this long strap option. I love the fact that I can just pop it on my shoulder. I can wear it as a crossbody if I want to. But obviously Obviously, it's an adorable handheld style as well. And then on the inside, it's just like the most simple thing ever. So it is just a wide open space, which is pretty much my favorite configuration of bags. There are no kind of pockets or bells or whistles or dividers. It is just very, very simple. I do have all the little kind of 
care card and the Loewe tag. Um, this one comes with a little bit of straw and then it kind of folds out, which I thought was quite cool. Uh, it's very comfortable to just carry in your hand. There isn't any fastening or closure, so that is something to keep in mind um, if you were interested in this. I know that is a deal breaker for some people. I don't mind that, um, but obviously something to bear in mind. And then on the base, it isn't reinforced, but because you have the double stitching right there, it does actually feel like it has a good amount of structure, which I really like. Same as the sides, like it doesn't feel like they're collapsing in. It actually feels like it stands up pretty well by itself. So I am super thrilled with this. I just thought it was so gorgeous. And this is one of the first Loewe styles, which I've seen and I'm like, oh my God, I love it. Like a lot of their styles I like, I just don't really, really love. Um, whereas this one, I just loved it instantly. So I am really, really happy with this. I think this is probably going to come to Italy with me. And yeah, I just think it's the most adorable style. But as I said, I did order the next size up to kind of compare. Um, I wasn't sure which one I'd go for at all. I hadn't seen these in real life, so I was literally just going by photos. Um, and it was a fairly close decision, um, but I ultimately went for the mini one just so I could comfortably wear it kind of cross body and on the shoulder. This one does come with a strap as well, um, but it is quite a bit bigger as you can see. You can wear this on the shoulder though, which is really nice, and it is a much more substantial bag in terms of the capacity like you can fit a lot inside you do also have the addition of leather pockets on the back there which is really nice if you do like a little bit of organization in your bag um one thing i would say though if you are considering this style is that i don't find that the raffia is particularly smooth so if you did want to wear this on the shoulder and obviously it's a summer bag so you might not be wearing it that much so you might have a little bit of skin showing it isn't the softest bag against your skin which is another thing that kind of tilted me towards the mini one i just didn't like how it felt up against my skin and i did think that I'd wear this a lot on the shoulder. So with that in mind and the fact that I liked wearing the mini one crossbody, I decided to go for that one. This is still a lovely option, particularly if you were planning on mainly wearing kind of crook of your arm or handheld. Um, but ultimately I went for the mini one, but this is really, really gorgeous as well. And speaking of fun tropical things, how gorgeous is this dress? Like I thought this was just the funnest thing for summer. I love the colorway. It's just full of peaches and pinks and reds and it's just such a pretty combination and the print is really cool as well it's not a floral print shockingly for me I've been really into my floral prints recently um but this one is a little bit bolder and more kind of solid in terms of the print and it's just the loveliest thing um you do have these really skinny spaghetti straps which are adjustable too the body is a stretch one so you can get a really nice close fit and then it flares out at the natural waist into this fairly large kind of a-line skirt it is a midi one um but i thought this was just so so cute really nice with just a pair of sandals i'm probably going to wear it more casually but if you wanted to transition it to evening with heels as well you absolutely could do and i think it would look beautiful with some jewelry and I just thought this was adorable like so so nice Um, it's a nice kind of matte fabric as well you do have pockets on the sides too but it doesn't add any extra width around the hips which is really nice and this is just oh, so so lovely I am so excited about the colorway and the print it's just so different and fresh looking and now for an adorable pop of color how pretty is this shade it's a really vibrant shade of aqua blue really really gorgeous and there's a lot of ruching going on here and it's a really kind of it's more of like a relaxed easygoing dress so i love things like this for when you are traveling or abroad and you want like a breakfast dress i call them so something that you just throw on when you're rolling out of bed you want to look cute for breakfast but you want something easygoing doesn't crease and you just throw on and go this is that like i have a couple of these in my wardrobe and they get so much use and wear in my wardrobe both on holiday and also at home as well because at at home I just use them as air running dresses and they're just fantastic and um, this is a really nice midi length style it does not crease easily but it does have a kind of more crinkle look effect which is kind of what contributes to the fact that it's pretty much crease proof because it's just part of the look it is a nice kind of medium weight fabric as well it is fully lined and it's just a really really nice one to throw on and go you could dress it up if you wanted to but I think it works really nicely as just an easygoing casual dress and just as such a useful piece in your wardrobe. 
And now for this really vibrant dress. I thought this color was so beautiful. I don't have too much red in my wardrobe, but I just love this. Like it's a really pretty shade of deep red, but with like a hint of cherry or pink in it. Really, really beautiful. Um, I actually wore this the wrong way when I first tried it on. I don't know why I assumed it was styled this way, um, but I actually tied the straps as a halter neck. And I think it really, really works. Um, but then I looked at the photo and I realized it was supposed to be tied as a kind of like just peekaboo effect, like tie detail around the bust. So I feel like you could wear it both ways if you wanted to. Um, I certainly think it works both ways. It is a smidge tight around the bust area. So I do think I could do with the neck size up. I still want to breastfeed for a few more months, so I'm not sure whether I should exchange it for the next size up or keep the one I have. I'm a little bit undecided about that, um, but it's definitely a little snug around the bust area. It does have adjustable straps though, um, which is always really helpful. And then it just kind of flares out, so it's fitted around the bust and then it flares down into a three-tiered skirt. It does have this crepe black fabric, which I definitely feel like is a bit of a trend this year, like I'm seeing it so much. It is fully lined and and it is a long midi skirt. So it's a little bit dramatic and I just think this colorway is beautiful. I think this would look fantastic with some like white statement earrings. Really lovely with the tan as well. I am not tan at all. Even though the weather has been so nice, I feel like I'm always inside on really hot sunny days. Um, but I love the color regardless and I just think it is the prettiest design whichever way you want to wear it. And then last but not least, I have this absolutely gorgeous dress. And this is definitely not one for someone who doesn't like their florals because it is both very floral, fairly pink, and also a bit glittery as well. So it is the trifecta of girly things, um, but I think it's so special looking, like it is so, so nice. Uh, so it is this really vibrant color mix of peaches and kind of like rustic reds. You have some violets in there, some blue, some green, like it is just multicolored, but done in a really elegant way because the colors were almost watercolor-like, like really kind of pared down and beautiful. It is a pleated skirt, um, but it is a multi-tier skirt as well. This one is fully lined. The lining is a beautiful dusky pink. And then on the neckline, it is a v-neck. And then you have these beautiful little ruffle sleeves, which I thought were so lovely. And um, the little kind of sparkle effect all the way through, just a gold thread that runs all the way through. Very, very subtle, not too much at all, but just adds like a little something extra. I think I'm probably gonna belt this one. It does come already cinched as part of the design of the dress, but I think it would look really nice just with, you know, a smart little white belt just to further cinch it in and kind of pull it together. And I thought this was beautiful. I have a fairly fancy brunch coming up, so I thought I could wear this then. It really has that nice floral look without being too much. So if you were going to an afternoon to your garden party, I think this would be perfect. But I think it will work beautifully for brunch as well. And I'm just so in love with this. Just the prettiest, most elegant dress. So that is it for this video guys, I hope that you enjoyed it. As usual I will include links to everything I featured in the description section below. If you have any questions for me then leave me a comment and please do give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy new and my wardrobe videos. As always thank you so much for watching, I will see you on my next one. Bye guys!